Leaders of the G7 grouping and its five partner countries, including India, on Monday said that they seek to promote a rules-based international order, respect other states' territorial integrity and sovereignty, respect and defend the principles enshrined in the UN Charter. They also vowed to remain steadfast in their commitment to defending peace, human rights, and the rule of law. In a joint statement, the group of seven uh, G7, an intergovernmental political grouping, acknowledged the importance of national laws and regulations that are in place in each country to advance the principles and values of democracy. We, the leaders of Germany, Argentina, Canada, France, India, Indonesia, Italy, Japan, Senegal, South Africa, the UK, the US and the European Union affirm our commitment to strengthening the resilience of our democracies and to working towards equitable, inclusive and sustainable solutions to global challenges, including climate change and the COVID-19 pandemic and reaffirm our commitment to the rules-based international order, it said. It took note of 2021 Kabis Bay Open Society statement and recognized the dramatic changes in the geopolitical situation since then and the significant threats to democratic systems around the world. In the statement, the leaders said they remain steadfast in their commitment to defending peace, human rights, the rule of law, human security and gender equality as recognized by international law, including the United Nations Charter, and call on their international partners to join them in these efforts. We commit to engage with partners internationally for peace and prosperity, and will work for progress towards an equitable world because we are stronger together, it said. The statement said that G7 seeks to promote a rules-based international order, respect other states' territorial integrity and sovereignty, respect and defend the principles enshrined in the UN Charter, support the peaceful resolution of conflicts, oppose the threat or use of force of any kind that is not in compliance with international law, protect human rights, strengthen multilateral institutions to address global challenges, and develop and use technologies in accordance with democratic principles for the benefit of humanity. The statement assumes significance amidst aggressive moves by China in the strategic Indo-Pacific region as well as Russia's invasion of Ukraine. India, the US and several other world powers have been uh, talking about the need to ensure a free, open and thriving Indo-Pacific in the backdrop of China's aggressive military maneuvering in the region. China also claims nearly all of the disputed South China Sea, though Taiwan, the Philippines, Brunei, Malaysia and Vietnam all claim parts of it. Beijing has built artificial islands and military installations in the South China Sea. India has oil exploration projects in the Vietnamese waters in South China Sea. India and Vietnam are boosting their maritime security cooperation in the last few years to protect common interests. Thank you.